freaking mower. Shoo! All right, well, we just bought a new mower, ladies and gentlemen. Um, we had to step it up, folks. You guys like the landscaping stuff so much. I said, listen, we got to step it up a notch. We got to get some big decks. So I got the biggest one they had. Yeah, we came actually to get the smallest 60-inch deck they had. And we got the biggest. And you walked out of the showroom with the Cadillac lawnmowers they had. Well, listen, those guys are some good salesmen in there. Look at the rims on that son of a gun. Good night. So this is uh, big man. I mean, look at, look at, look at the float. The whole thing is like a zero gravity the whole, chair. The whole float. We got our, we have our old mower with us because we we're already in town with it, doing some you know landscaping stuff as you guys have seen. And it's oh, they'll both fit. That's yeah, good. Fit. But uh, yeah, I'd say they're very different. That's a yeah, that's a 52 incher or 50 incher. This is a 60, so you get 10 more inches of cutting diameter width, which is good. That thing is uh, what size? They're both cowies. Um, you know what size this one was? 23. 23 horse. And this was 35. So we got 12 more HPs, my guy. Big old HPs. So, big mom, I know, it's fancy. Some of you guys, hey, player, you just you get all the fancy bougie stuff. It just listen. They had a good deal in here, okay? I said, if we're going to be doing the lawnscape and stuff, you guys like the lawn renovation videos. If we're going to be doing it, we need something bigger, faster, and more comfortable so I don't blow my back out because I've got lower back issues. So, all right, load her up. Let's see. I want to see with you versus. You, no, you versus the guy she tells not to worry about. That's what I'm here to see. But we're gonna take this home, get it, get this thing all juiced up or whatever it needs to happen to it, I guess. And then we'll end up probably going somewhere, maybe to the ranch. Yeah, look, we look official. Look at us. Look at the difference right there, buddy. Sheesh. I mean, I like the mower, the other mower. I really like it. There's nothing wrong with it. It just, it's not comfortable. It's, it's cut small, it's not fast. It's great for my house, um, but that's gonna be better for the house. So I don't know, I mean, for now I'll keep it just to have a little extra go-getter, go but I think that guy's- It'll be nice for our lawnscape and stuff. We can rip two mowers. True. Like, we can do way bigger True. We can, now, yeah, now we, we can rip two. We can, we can get the old double duty going. So we can, yeah, we can run, you're right, we can run two zero turns in one property. Now we're getting it done twice as fast, which could be uh, super handy uh, to get, get stuff done. I mean, like I said, you guys like the landscape videos. We're like, hey, we'll keep doing them. But then, you know, the business guy in me is like, how do we do these the fastest, most efficient, um, so we can post the most entertaining videos for you guys, still have time to go post on the main channel, do all the other stuff we have going on. So the solution, my solution, buy the biggest zero turn they had. That's all we got, folks. You guys enjoy us doing some mowing. Stay tuned. Shoo! Alrighty, folks. Well, it's the next day. We got the brand new spanking mower. We hadn't used it yet, and we brought it down to the ranch to put it to the test. Uh, if you guys don't know, this is my ranch. Uh, it used to be a high fence ranch. We tore the fence down, and it's uh, about 400 acres of primo hunting for deer, and we're trying to build a lake here. There's a whole bunch of stuff. So if you guys are new here, and uh, you haven't seen the main channel, uh, the main channel's got a ton of videos about it, but the ranch has not been mowed yet. First cut of the year. I know, we're late, I know. We used to have, I used to have people come down and do it, but I was like, I, I got too cheap. And I was like, ah, it's fine, it's just the ranch, not a big deal. But now that I got the big beefy mower, I mean, all this needs to be mowed. Not, I mean, not in a thousand percent, but any of that tall yellow stuff will probably leave, but we mow all the way around, all the way around the cabin, all the way around here, there's the shop. Um, we got a bunch of stuff going on, but I wanted to get this place cleaned up, and I figured the perfect place to break in the brand spanking new mower. The old 60 inch is uh, is at the ranch. So uh, we just dropped it off, we're ready to go, and we're gonna, we're gonna give it the old mow. I'm gonna try to roll raw. I want you guys to see what it's like to mow the ranch, and uh, We'll just see what, see what this bad boy is going to put to the test because it's long. You can see it sitting in that nice tall grass. Hopefully I don't hit anything and break anything. But that's the plan right now. Mow everything here. Mow by the entrance, by the cedars. Everything you see here has got to be mowed. So with that being said, you guys enjoy. Shoo! All right, baby. Oh, look at the old zero gravity action we got going here. All right, Sheila. Uh, choke out. Give her the old, oh, deep break. Give it a little turn.
have, folks. That was a uh, 28 minutes of pure getting it. Uh, as you can tell, I was not taking my time. I ain't striping nothing. Okay, I'm just making this thing so you can get covered in ticks when you just want to walk around the yard. We also have a bunch of pickups and trailers everywhere, so I wasn't able to mow absolutely everything. But this thing's fast. And it, like I said, it wasn't clean because I was cutting out, I think, about four inches, three and a half, four inches. So a little high, but obviously the grass was high. Um, so, I mean, that'll do for now. If we want to come back and make it look all nice, drop it down three inches and give her the old, give her the old perm cut. But we got everything by the entrance. I tried to go around these tra trailers and trucks, kind of in front of the shop, all the way around the cabin. For 28 minutes, I feel like that's not bad. If I remember, I, uh, I had some neighbor boys mow this last year. They told me two zero turns and a trimmer guy. It took like an hour and they billed me like 200 bucks or something. So obviously I ain't, about, I ain't about that life. I'm about the DIY life now. That wasn't too bad. Like I said, 28 minutes of, like I said, it ain't looking pretty. It's just to keep it mowed down so that way you can walk out here with shorts and not get covered in ticks if you know that's really the idea and make it nice and comfortable so that's it uh the new mower i'd say works pretty good i only hit one stump um which isn't bad okay i thought that was through the tire that's good you know the ranches that's a rough place to start um this is but it's, it's supposed to be a commercial grade so it should be for some of those bigger a little bigger branches a little bit bigger objects stuff like that so I don't think it was too bad. Like I said, you get beat. I couldn't even imagine on my other one that has no air ride or no whatever that. That's got a different thing than the air ride. It's got a, an operator pod system. Basically, you're on zero gravity chair. It's bougie. Most expensive one they had at the location. And I was like, listen, we got to get, if we're going to do it, we got to do it right. We got to get the high end big dog. So that way we can keep making these lawnscaping videos for you guys. And, and that way now we've got two. So if it's Jake and I, we both can do, we have to run two zero turns. So if we wanted to go do some bigger yards, which I'm thinking we will, we can run two, get them done faster so we can accomplish more things, do more yards, you know, the whole doing, you know, taking care of lawns for free type thing. I think it's something that we're going to keep on doing. Um, so we're getting the gear for it, but if we're missing anything, um, as far as gear wise, you know, two zero turns, this one's a 60 inch. Um, the one I have is a 50. So I know you're supposed to have the same size because if you're going to stripe, it doesn't look different, but that's what we're dealing with right now. We've got trimmers and blowers and everything. So I think we have everything we need, but had to break the old zero turn in. I feel like the ranch was the perfect place to do it. It needed it. It needed a good old fashioned trim. So stay tuned for more landscaping and construction videos on the next episode. Peace.